Hi guys, it's Tiffany here to do my recap. Um, I traded NEO this morning. Uh, first off, for those of you that have watched my last recap, you know that I'm waiting 15 minutes um, after the open to take my first trade this week because I upped my risk. And so I really felt like I missed a ton of really great opening range breakouts um, in the first 15 minutes. Um, but this NEO, it, it it appears to be um, a great 15 minute opening range breakout, but the reason I didn't take it as that is because as, as you can see on the five minute chart right here, after the first 15 minute candle closed, um, the it was kind of too far away from the VWAP and I have these daily levels marked at 44.50 and, and 45. And so the risk to reward wasn't there. Um, so I decided not to take it as a 15 minute opening range breakout. Uh, but I did see that um, it was doing a little reversal and, and my goal was to get it back to the VWAP. It did a bit of a head and shoulders on the one minute chart. There were some um, nice doji candles with large wicks to the top side, pushing up through those daily levels that I had marked. And you have the nine and the 20 right here crossing over and curling down. And so when that happened, it was losing these moving averages. I went short and my stop loss was above the nine moving average on the one minute. My first partial was taken at the nine moving average on the five minute and then at the VWAP. And then I went all out when it made a new five minute high. And then I traded Walmart. This was a Benzinga trade. Um, one of the perks about being a part of the BBT community is you have access to Benzinga news. Uh, when I can't find something to trade, I love to have, I love to have squawk on and, and today it called out Walmart around two o'clock. Um, as you can see right here on the five minute, this large candle right here is when, when I heard the news on um, come through on squawk. So I sat and watched it uh, calm down a little bit because it wasn't really it wasn't that um, clear of a reversal. So it came down and tested that the low again. And um, it started making new highs on the five minute, the 15 minute, and um, this 9 and 20 started curling up. The 50 came down to meet it. Um, I went long and I decided to go all out at the previous, um, the previous daily level. Um, <clears throat> I, I know that it did end up reaching the VWAP. However, I'm, I'm kind of glad that I did end up um, going all out here, it would have came back and stopped me out on the pullback at break even after taking this first partial. Um, so I got about almost a three to one, or it, I think it was a three to one risk to reward ratio on this Walmart trade. Thanks to Benzinga. Um, I, everything was very choppy today. And like I said earlier, I couldn't find a, a, a really good setup. So, um, Benzinga was my friend today. <laughs> um, I hope you all had a great day and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.